This information session has been created to assist personnel to better understand and carry out the most commonly used drill movements used by all members of the Australian Navy cadets. Although the information to be given in this session is not intended to replace formal training, all of the drill you are about to see is in accordance with the ANC Dress, Grooming and Ceremonial Manual and therefore can be used as a helpful knowledge resource. In this information session we will be covering the following drills. Moving a squad by stepping forward or backward. Moving a squad by side closing paces. Open and close order march from three ranks. Falling out and in from a squad from front center and rear rank. General rules for falling in and out of a squad. Moving a squad by stepping forward or backward. When the order is given to step forward or backward, it is preceded by a number no more than four paces at a time. For our example, we will be using two paces. At the order, two paces forward or backwards, march. Each member of the squad steps forward or backwards two paces, always commencing with the left foot. The length of pace is approximately 600 millimeters and the arms and hands remain locked into the side. The timing for two paces is one, one down. Moving a squad by side closing paces. When ordering this drill, it is preceded by a number of no more than six side closing paces at any time. This drill is the same for the left and right. For our example, we will be using two side closing paces. At the order two paces right or left march, each member of the squad carries their right or left foot approximately 300 millimeters directly to the right or left and then closes the left or right foot to it, thus completing the pace. The next and subsequent paces are taken in the same manner. Whilst conducting this drill, shoulders are to be square and the legs straight without bending at the knee. Direction of movement must be kept in a straight line. Open and close order march from three ranks. The next drill is the open and close from three ranks. This drill is normally used when a reviewing officer is inspecting the squad or platoon. At the order squad, open order, march, the front rank steps forward two paces at the same time the rear rank steps two paces backwards. The centre rank does not move. Whilst on the move, the squad's arms and hands remain locked into the side. At the order squad, close order, march, the front rank steps backwards two paces at the same time the rear rank steps two paces forward. The centre rank does not move. Whilst on the move, the squad's arms and hands remain locked into the side. The timing for this drill is one, one down. Falling out and in from a squad from front centre and rear rank. Falling out. This drill is to be conducted with a squad at full arm intervals and normally at attention. If the order is given when the squad is at ease prior to conducting the drill, the nominated member is to come to the position of attention before carrying out the order. When this order is given, it is preceded with a number and what rank they are in. For our examples, we will be using the following. At the order 2, front rank fall out. The nominated member of the front rank will acknowledge the order with the reply Sir, Chief, Ma'am, etc. The member will then take a pace forward and after a short pause turn towards the person giving the order and march to that person. At the order Fall, Centre Rank Fall Out, the nominated member of the centre rank will acknowledge the order with the reply Sir, Chief, Ma'am, etc. The member will then take an uncompleted side closing pace to the right with the right foot and carry the left foot forward to take two paces forward through the spaces in the frontage of the front rank and after a short pause turn towards the person giving the order and march to that person. At the order three rear rank fall out, the nominated member of the rear rank will acknowledge the order with the reply Sir, Chief, Ma'am, etc. 
The member will then take a pace backwards and after a short pause, turn towards the person giving the order and march to that person. Falling in. At the order fall in, front rank, the nominated member marches back until they are one pace clearer of their original position. Turn and face away from the front rank and after a slight pause, take one step backward and on completion, pick up the dressing. Centre rank. The nominated member marches back to position where they exited and hold one pace clear of their original position. Turn and face away from the front rank. After a pause, take two paces to the rear through the front rank, commencing with the left foot and carrying the left foot off to the left for a side closing pace on completion, assuming the position of attention. On completion, pick up dressing. Rear rank. The nominated member marches back until they are one pace clearer of their original position. Turn and face the rear rank after a slight pause, take one step forward and on completion pick up the dressing. General rules for falling in and out of a squad. When falling back into the squad which is at ease, the member who is to the right of the person returning comes to attention on completion of the falling in drill so that the returning member can dress off correctly. On completion of dressing, they both stand at ease together. Sailors at the end of the middle rank step into the squad for the first half pace, even if this requires the first pace to be to the right with the right leg. Middle rank is never to step out of the squad on the first step. This now completes this information session. If you have any queries, please do not hesitate to contact Staff Officer Boats and Firearms on 02 6266 4084 or Flotilla Support Officer Victoria on 03 5931 5863.